terrible at doing my hair. Okay, uh, we, we know that. And uh, I hide a lot of my imperfections in photos and lots of other things with clips like like these. These are these are ones that are made. Uh, however, yesterday I had an event to go to and I was like, I was wearing green, I was wearing the Michelin pit by Unique Vintage, the green dress, and um, I was like, these don't go, and yes, we're going into fall, but it's not winter yet, and I don't know what to wear, so I went to Icing Icicles, it's run by Claire, I don't know, really, um, and then I found this. And I put my hair with the help of my friend Carol, and we put it up and we went like this. Now this isn't something new or original, but for those out there who have a hard time doing their hair just like I do and need to hide all their imperfections and maybe some extra bobby pins, uh, this is going to be helpful. Maybe. You don't have to do it. But I was like, I feel further, so I'm going to make a video on it, and that's what we're doing. Let's get, oh, oh, let's get started. Okay, so some essential things that you're gonna need is a brush, a brush, you know, the comey brush, and you're going to need a donut. I use blonde, because I used to be blonde, and now I'm red, and for some reason I still relate to blonde. I don't know. This, you have to be very careful with this. There are no redheads, there are brown ones, and black ones, and blonde ones, uh, as far as I know. I don't really do much research into it, but I, I use this. Okay, so the first thing I like to do is make my little hoop de doo my little, my little jelly roll. I don't, that's not a jelly roll, but yeah, yeah, okay. So, okay guys, we are going to just take this section. Now, you want to make sure that it's a nice, I can't see anything, but you want to make sure it's a nice, try it, uh, a rectangle. And you want to know how I know that? Because Miss Victory Violet taught me in one of those videos. And if you want to go check it out, well, check out one of those videos. It'll be in a link, like right over here on YouTube. We are going to tease the heck out of this section. Okay, gonna make it look, as she says, like a cave woman. See, I'm getting good at this teasing thing. Brushing it out is a whole other story. But I'm getting good at this part. And we're gonna air spray it. Yes. And with this little doodad, this brush, it's a its a brush that is more like a brush than a comb, but it kind of looks like a comb. We're going to smooth it out, but we're not going to brush through the teasing. Just kind of like that, except there's hair over there. Okay. Okay. And I like to make sure that this section is nice and smooth because that's where the roll is going to go. So then when I feel like it's pretty okay decent, I go ahead and take it. And then I wrap my two fingers like this. Do you see it? I take my two fingers and I go underneath and I start rolling. Now when I roll, my goal is, yeah, not that. My goal is to get it kind of underneath the roll, see, kind of like that, so that when you pull it in, it's now underneath it. Okay. And then we like to form it. Now when I form my little rolly roll, I like it to kind of go upwards and open so that people can see the mess inside. <laughs> I like to show them my talents. And I take bobby pins and I go ahead and stick them in. Now some people will tell you that you want to hide your bobby pins and in some instances, like I will show you with the flowers, yeah. But in this instance, if they see it, it's a part of life. They should know by now that this can't stay up without bobby pins or some type of clip or like just extreme amount of hairspray. Um, so you know, they know it's there. It's fine. If they see it, it's fine. So then I go ahead and I bring it down. So I bring it down. And I take another clippy clip that I'm not going to hide. And I stick. Sometimes one works. And today it seems like one works. But I actually am very happy with that. So we're going to move on. Now taking your hairbrush, your, no, hair tie, hair tie, you're going to put it on your wrist. Then you're going to take your little brushy brush. The more videos I do of these, I should probably learn the terms. And we're going to brush it. And we're going to just make it as smooth as possible. That looks smooth enough. And we're going to put it in a ponytail. That doesn't feel smooth, but it's smooth enough. And then I take my hairspray. And I just hairspray the bejesus out of it. So then I take my donut. Donut. And I stick it on the back. Now I'm not gonna lie, this is 
where things get difficult, and this is why you need lots of body pins and something to cover your imperfection. So, I take a section of the hair right here. Take th this is, my, remember, this is just how I do it. I should, I haven't, like, this is not how probably anybody else does it, but this is how I do it. So, I take this section and I bring it up. And then I pull it down on the inside of that donut. Now, then I begin to use my fingers and spread out the hair. This takes a lot of patience, which I don't have, which is why I normally just hide it in a hair roll. I roll it and then I kind of just bring it up like this and I bobby pin everything into place. So that's the extent of how that's gonna go right now. Um, then I go ahead and I take this, which is apparently a Coachella headband, and I go ahead and I wrap it around. And then I double, I take it up, I go back around the bun if I can nicely, but probably not nicely. And now all of you guys think that I can do hair. Except I'm going to get a few comments that was like, no, I don't think you can do hair. Why are you making this video? Because you can't do hair. All of these mean things, and I get it. I can't do hair. I get it. Okay, that was all. This was, that was this video today. You're welcome. Greatest tutorial ever. Check out some of the links down below. I've linked some of my favorite pinup people to teach you how to do hair. They are amazing. You can also just type in pinup hairstyles as I did yesterday and a plethora, plethora of videos pop up. So you are not short. This is just if you can't do hair. Mm -hmm. Don't forget guys to stay scrumptious and I will see you here later. Thank you so much to my Patreons. You are what make these videos possible. You are amazing and I love you so much. Thank you David. Thank you Mr. Ruby's Music. Thank you uh, Stephanie. Thank you. Mwah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Don't forget to stay scrumptious. I already said that. And I'll see you here later. I already said that too. Yeah, okay. Well, yeah, right. I'm gonna go now.